Hey, I want to start with something with you called Metabolic Mondays, where we're going to talk about metabolism and little bits and pieces of metabolism so that you can better understand how to take care of yourself. Today, we're going to talk about insulin. Before we do that, let's talk about just general metabolism. What does that mean? Metabolism is taking your body, putting food in, and getting energy. That's the basic definition of metabolism. And insulin is a key factor in this because insulin is a signal that, or excuse me, is a hormone that's going to help you absorb carbohydrates, protein, and fat. Uh, and it's really, really important that you learn how to take care of insulin because excess insulin actually causes metabolic inflammation as well as um, it's going to cause weight gain and, and various other problems if you don't learn how to regulate it. So if you eat the standard American diet full of you know, pizza, pop, et cetera, it's going to cause these huge insulin spikes, which eventually you'll end up in an office like mine trying to figure out how to regulate this better. So we're just going to teach you now. So starts here in the nose. You're going to breathe in the smell of those foods. Your brain's going to start releasing digestive enzymes, including stomach acid. That stomach acid is going to be a signal to your pancreas to release that insulin so you can start breaking those uh, or so you can start absorbing your food. So as I said, it's mostly carbohydrates, protein. It is affected by protein. Your, your stomach acid breaks protein down into amino acids and insulin is going to help absorb those amino acids. But lastly, fat, um, insulin is a signal for what's called lipogenesis or the production of fat. So any excess energy is going to be converted into fat, especially if your insulin levels are going like this throughout the day. So learning to eat um, appropriately is going to help you regulate that. Mostly what we encourage is intermittent fasting and elimination of standard American diet processed foods and focusing on whole food um, proteins. Uh, proteins, fruits, and veggies. So that's Metabolic Monday. Uh, there is in this post, I'll put a link to Dr. Ben Beckman's book that you have to read. I think every human should have to read this book. Um, so there'll be a link there. Enjoy, and we'll see you on the next video.